Hey guys, it's Mafanela here, and today I am showing you how to download Fraps and install Fraps free. Full, well, it's the full version, but I have found a link that's free for the full version. You don't have to do any cracks, no serial codes or anything like that. You just download it free. Okay, so what you want to do is go into the description, and there'll be a link which is up here, and you go to that link, and it'll take you to this place. Um, the latest version is Fraps 3.5.9. It's for Windows XP, 2003, Vista, and Windows 7. I believe there is a one for Windows 8, but uh, um, I shall put the Windows 8 version also in the description. Okay, just go to click download. I don't need to download it because I've already downloaded it. So but once it's downloaded, just go to um, just go to my downloads. Should be. Yeah. We'll open up this. Uh, this is probably be in a WinRAR file um, or in a normal file for you guys. Uh, then you just double click the ex exe and it will take you through the take you through the um, inst installation. So you, I agree. Pick your destination folder where you want it to go next, and then click install. But I don't need to do that because I've already installed it. Once you've installed it, um, this should pop up on your desktop, as you can see. Um, you just want to just go, just double click on it, press yes, and then you've got your full version right here. Uh, what you want to do um, is you want to record like games like Minecraft, RuneScape, uh, games like that. You want to go, well, first of all, you want to go into your FPS. Um, this means that there'll be a little overlay saying how good your FPS is, which will be in the top left corner for me. Um, benchmarking key, this is just benchmarking, I don't think you really need this. Let's go into movies. Um, this is where it'll save your movies. Don't forget, Fraps does also, um, once it's done, it's about a 10 minute video will be about 3 gig. It is quite, they are quite big folders. But that's why I downloaded this, which I'll go through a tutorial, which will be a little annotation popping up now saying go to this bit. Um, that's just how to sort. This is just the uh, handbrake, which is which gets the three gig to about 20, 30 megabytes. Um, yeah, it's really good that. Uh, you should consider clicking on that and looking at that. Okay, so once you're in movies, it changes. To, you can change this to wherever you want. I've got it in my F, which is my separate hard drive. We've got a video catch hotkey, which is how to start the recording and stop the recording. Uh, you can disable it so it's non, but I don't know how that's going to work. But you can press any key, so you can have it as one. Well, it's going to be have to be F something, but I use F9. Um, things like RuneScape and Minecraft can only record at 29.9. Well, YouTube basically only takes 29.97 of the uh, frames per second so um, if you're going to go like up here somewhere click on this box here and type in 29.97 and yeah that that will get you the best quality you can get of course if you want to record the sound coming out of your speakers which will be the sound that this computer will take out the audio jack uh, you can just record Windows 7 sound and click stereo so this is like if you're playing Minecraft, it'll be like the dirt blocks that are breaking, or if you're gonna play RuneScape, it'll be like the fighting and stuff. And here is the record external input, which is your microphone. If you want, to, don't want that. But if you click yes, it'll want it'll also just pick your microphone device. It'll find it for you. You don't want to do that because you don't want to be pressing space for the whole video, of course. And uh, this is just hide mouse cursor in the video if you want to do that. Um, I don't know what that is. I think that's just lock frame rate, like, which basically pauses it. Um, force, yeah, that that makes it a lot slower. But it makes it, um, it basically just takes away the RGB, which is basically the extra graphics that you have to like make your videos better. Here is a screenshot. So you can just take screenshots as F10. I put. And obviously, you can take it to PNG, I just put BMP. There we go. 
So that's basically how you go through fraps. Make sure you download the 3.5.9 version, which is the latest version out. And yeah, let's just have a little test, see how it works. So he's gonna, I'm just gonna go uh, use Minecraft as a demonstration. See the little benchmark in the corner tells you how much FPS you have, frames per second. That's terribly bad at the moment. So I'm just gonna go on to a world like, just go into a random world. Of course, my frame rate is gonna be in the corner. And um, yeah, so placing blocks and stuff, taking blocks away. So let's just record in here, and I'll show you the I'll show you the video. So let's just press F9 whilst we're in game. As you can see, the corner of the screen has now turned red, which will now show and indicate that it's recording. And then when you press F9 again, it will. Um, It'll, just, it'll stop the video, so let's just try that. See now it's gone back to come back to its normal color there. As you can see, so let's just exit out of Minecraft, put Fraps back in its place, and I'm going to go to the destination where I set Fraps to go, which is there. So I'm going to go into my computer, my F hard drive, and go into Program Files, and then Movies. The latest one we just did is here, so let's just show you guys this. As you can see, the corner of the screen has now turned red, which will now show and indicate that it's... There we go. Let us put the music down then. I don't know if you could hear the music whilst I turned it down because it was like echoing in the mic but there we go that's the video and it's pretty high quality let's go back to that now and show you how good the quality is I forgot to do that so program files movies and then jump into this now as you can see see very good quality but it probably doesn't look good quality at the moment because um, because I was recording, it probably didn't look very good then, only because I was recording over that, but when you're recording in screen, only with fraps, it looks great. Okay, so thanks for watching guys, please comment, rate and subscribe, and yeah, see you guys later, bye.